Now 95, right here bringing you yet another Moab. This time it says Assault Moab on Sea Town. Uh, it's quite a good Moab because I've finished 90 to 8, I think it was. Yeah, I think it was 90 to 8. Uh, it's quite a good Moab because it is with the ACR again, yeah, I know. But the reason why I'm using ACR because people now are using ACRs, MP7s, a it's just all the other power guns. It's blind eye assassins, sitting corners, anything possible to, you know, try and ruin your Moab Street. And I keep doing that with the M4 and stuff, and it's quite annoying that I could get stopped. But the last two gameplays, I did get differently because it was the M16. I think it was with the... Uh, I can't remember the other gun, actually. What was the other gun? I'm trying to think, though. <laughs> um, if, if it comes back to me, it comes back to me because, you know, it's quite hard to think. I just can't remember, really. Anyway. But, yes, this is my class. ACR, Silent Server, so Standard Mags, Secondary, MP9 Silencer, Semtex, Port Radar. Uh, my spe my scavenger assass no not scavenger quick draw and stalker my uh, assault kill streaks are predator a6 and look how low that a6 was I can't believe it gets that low generally in the game I do cut some clips by the way guys uh, just to let you know so it, like gets this bit go to another interesting section then it gets to more and then the game ends and it shows my score so exactly so you don't have to sit here 11 minutes watching the gameplay. But anyway, as I say, about the kill streaks, Predator, A6, and uh, Payload. The reason why I like those kill streaks because Predator, yeah, it's much more easy to take people out. Then you got other. Then here comes a the panic knife for the Moab. There we go. Uh, you got Payload that can kill people like a monster. You got also got A6 that can take people out in front of you before you approach the corner. So that can, that can be very helpful in some ways, but it can not be helpful. It really depends how you play it. Um, we did have a bit of a full party but that is what I want to talk about actually is um, the full party full party versus solo um, there is a difference solo is good if you want to get good like great gameplay like say you get a double, solo double mob that will be a great gameplay because you're playing by yourself no parties whatsoever you're doing it by yourself and you could achieve the double mob is really impressive for you Other, otherwise if you did it in a party it's not really that much impressive because you know it is not really good because you're with a whole party. If everyone has support for you, then it's quite crap. Uh, if you want to get a quad mob or p penta or a triple, uh, you need you do need a, uh, a full party for that. But you don't need a support really. We don't really need any support runners. You can just use teamwork, pull up UAVs and stuff. You know that'd be much more helpful for you and your team. Ballistic vests can be helpful, but people do dislike people using ballistic vests a lot. Because they do give you a bit of extra health, so exactly it means you're invincible. I do pick up a pair of blizzards here, but this dropped out right at near the end, which was a very stupid idea. Her just really decided to do that. I am playing the full party here to get the assault mob because to play ground war, you really do need a full party, otherwise, you just get people mixed up the spawns. I do usually play kill confirm or domination quite a lot, not the other lot though, it's just mostly these modes really. But it's quite impressive this Moab, like I said, because it is 90 to 8 uh, Moab. I could have got 100 plus quite easily, but I did die 8 times, like I said. And also, some of my other friends were using assault kill streaks, exactly. It did take half of my uh, kills away, like so, like then. That was not my kill, it was a Mega Lynx who took that kill. So guys, I really did hope you enjoyed this video. Please hit that like button, possibly could this video hit 20 likes, that would be quite amazing, guys. Could you also leave a comment, because I do read every comment here. And hit that subscribe button for more content coming soon. And get ready for Black Ops 2. Peace.